Hello Year One and welcome to your maths lesson number one. Today we're going to be having a look at number bonds to 20 and we're going to be using Numicon to help us solve those different questions. Now before we begin we're going to count to 20 and we're going to clap along. So get your hands ready and let's clap. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Well done, that was fantastic counting. I want you to keep practicing your counting every day. Tomorrow we might count to 50. Oh, fantastic. Now, I have got a little, uh, some pieces of Numicon that I want us to have a look at and see if we can remember the value of the Numicon, okay? So I'm going to show you a piece and I want you to tell me the value of that Numicon. Are you ready? Here's our first piece. What piece is this? That's right, it's the three. Look for the next one. Oh, what is this one? It's the 10. Oh, and this one? Can you count them? It's the seven, well done. What about this one here? That's right, it's the four. Okay, I have some more pieces now. Hmm, what was this one? That's right, it's the number one. Oh, what about this one? The value of that is eight. And this one? It's nine. And this one? Excellent, it's two. And what about this one? That's right, it's five. And the last one here? It's six. Well done. Well done for spotting the value of each of those Numicon pieces. You're going to need that knowledge shortly. OK, let's have a look at these number bonds to 10 here, 20, sorry, here. So here I have a 10 piece. 10 plus what would give me 20? Hmm. 10 plus something would give me 20. If I have a look at my answer here, can you see the two pieces of Numicon? What two pieces do we have here? That's right, we have a 10 and a 10. So 10 plus 10 gives us 20. There we go, well done. Okay. What about this one? Ah, so we've got the nine piece. Nine plus what would give me 20? Oh, nine plus what? Nine plus what? Oh, that's a tricky one. Let's see. Hmm. Nine plus 11. Can you see this one piece would fit here next to the nine and that would give me 10. Then I would have a 10 and a 10. But we've split it, we've partitioned it. So we have a nine and a 10 and a one. Hmm. This time I've got eight and what? Eight and what makes 20? Eight and what makes 20? Oh, well, let's see. It's 12, excellent. This two piece, would fit with this eight piece to give me 10. And remember, 10 and 10 make 20, but we've partitioned this number here and put it with this one. So we've got eight and 10 and two, which give me 12. Eight and 12 give me 20. Here I've got, oh, a 10 and a seven piece together. And that gives me 17. 17, Add what would give me 20? What piece could I fit with that seven to give me another 10? Mm. What piece could I fit to that seven to give me 10? Oh, that's right, the three. 17 and three make 20, well done. Oh, I've got a six. 
six, a six piece. What could I fit with the six piece to give me 20? Excellent, well done. 14, so I've got my 10. I put my, this, if I put this four piece with the six piece, that would also give me 10, but we have partitioned it. Oh, now I've got five. Oh, five and what make 20? Five and what make 20? Hmm. Hmm. What do you think? Should we see if you're right? Excellent. Yes, it was 15. If I put my five and five together, that would give me 10. And we have partitioned that. So I've got a five, a 10 and a five. 10 and a five is 15. 15 and five make 20. Oh, now I have a four. I wonder if you can remember from earlier, we had a four with a 10. What was that other piece that was with it? Hmm. Four and that's it, 16. Fantastic, well done. What about this one? 13 and what? Give me 20. 13 and what? What piece could I fit with that three? Excellent. The seven. 13 and seven give me 20. Oh, now what about this one? Can you remember? 12 and what gives me 20? 12 and eight gives me 20. Well done. What about this one now? 11. Oh, 11 and excellent. 11 and nine. 11 and nine give me 20. Fantastic. Oh, can you remember this one? 15 add what gives me 20? What could I add to that five to make it into a 10? For a 10 and a 10 to make 20. Five and a five. Excellent, well done. Well done, year one. You were fabulous at those number bonds to 20. Now, what I'd like you to do is have a look at the sheet and I want you to have a go at some number bonds to 20 yourself. If you can't print off the sheet, then just have a go at writing some out. You could also have a go at drawing some of the Numicon shapes and see if you can remember the value to eat for each one. Have fun, year one. I'm looking forward to looking at your work. Take care. Bye.